support CGT, give us a subscribe. Hello and welcome, Viking Bart here. Today we're going to have a look at a nice solid gadget. Comes in this box, but that's just a box. What's it about? Well, it's this. It's the brick nick. Yes, it is just actually a brick, a clay brick. As you can see, it's quite large, two pieces of course, and there's a hole in them. Why is that? Because this gadget is all about making food. Making food by placing this brick on a barbecue, surrounding a campfire, fire, or just in the stove. And that's what I'm going to do. I got a nice fireplace at home. I'm going to heat it up, get some temperature in it, put my meal in it, place it in there and cook it. And we'll see if it really works and if my food is yummy. Let's have a go. As you can see, the fire is already going. It's nice and warm. So, what am I going to be cooking? I'll be cooking a nice carrot mix and a Flemish peasant sausage. So that's going to go in. I'm going to place it straight down the center. According to the manual, it takes about half an hour. I'm going to be putting it there for half an hour. So let's see what the result is in half an hour. Halfway. Not smelling the food yet. Only the fire. There are some black spots on the brick. That will be because of the fire, of course. And later we'll see if we can clean it off easily. So, 15 more minutes to go. Now, half an hour later. For those who will notice, the sound isn't really good because I was so excited I forgot to turn on the microphone. So, I'm going in, getting the Britnik out. I have to say, it's really, really hot. I was wearing special barbecue gloves who are kind of heat resistant, but in this case, it was really, really hot. So you can see there's some heat coming off of it, smoke, again it's really hot and the gloves didn't do really much good to it. So I'm opening it and as you can see looks kind of good. There are some black marks, some burns on the side but you can clearly see the sausage and the carrots. It does smell good already so I couldn't wait to taste it. As you can see, it keeps smoking. It's really, really hot. Sausage is more done on the top than on the bottom, but it's okay. I'm going to cut it open and see if it's well done or not, which is always important when it comes to food. And yes, it is really well done, it's good. The carrots itself look good, they're done. Just a small layer on the bottom that kind of got burned because it's just too hot. My suggestion, next time you put it more on the side of a fire like this, not in the middle, because then it gets really too hot for any meal to cook. Or you cook it less time. So instead of half an hour, you go for 20 minutes or so. Pretty sure it will be done. Uh, it is a nice concept. If you want to save some money on electricity bill or just have a nice way to serve your meal, go with it. Light the fire, light the barbecue, put the food in the bricknick, put the bricknick in the fire. 
and then just wait. Now as you can see I'm waiting to start eating it because I then realized from if I'm going to put that hot brick on my table it might make a burn spot. So use some rubber, use some cork, use anything heat resistant to put it on before eating. Here's an attempt to a close up of the food. It does look good, doesn't it? You can already taste it. So, if you like this gadget, gadget, have a go. Have some friends buy some of them too. Put them nice, put them around a campfire or on the barbecue. It makes it a little bit more special and fun. So, until next time. See ya.